During the observation of the Harris's antelope squirrel located at Piestawa Peak, the squirrels were frequently observed carrying food away from other squirrels that were present, which became a behavior of interest. This video follows a single adult Harris's antelope squirrel near the peak and was observed eating and foraging but not carrying the food in the presence of other individuals. From the individual or from the original observations, four hypotheses were made. For proximate causation or control, the presence of other squirrels present present a competitive threat to gather the most food which likely is the cause of this defense mechanism to protect its food findings and run away. According to a study on the feeding competition among female olive baboons conducted by Robert Barton, observed an increase in feeding competition between the baboons during dry season due to a low food availability making the foods more clumped in distribution. For the development as a juvenile squirrel, it is likely that other adult squirrels that were greater in size often were able to steal the food the juvenile collected, resulting in the juvenile learning to carry the food away in order to be able to eat and avoid having the food stolen. Ben Hirsch investigated spatial position in ring-tailed coaties and find it in feeding competition and found that the juvenile coaties appeared to choose spatial locations based on feeding success and not predation avoidance as a result of the feeding competition between its species. The feeding competition was coupled with the aggression that was present between the adults and subadults and the juveniles. For the function, carrying the food away ensures survival by allowing the individual to consume the food it has found without getting it stolen if other individuals are present. In a study conducted by C.R. Thalus, the feeding competition between grazing red deer hides was observed. Thalus found that the deer were more likely to leave the vicinity of other individual hinds while feeding, and the feeding rate increased with distance from neighbors. Their study suggested that feeding competition in the deer is a mainly passive process, operating through the avoidance of conflict by subordinates. For the evolution, the development of the Harris's cheek pouches allow for the squirrels to tuck away food while running away to find its burrow to eat in safety to avoid having its food stolen from another competitor. In an analysis of cheek pouch use and feeding competition in blue monkeys, Lindsay Smith investigated cheek pouches increasing feeding efficiency by reduction in competition when the nearest neighbor's rank increased subjects were more likely to increase than decrease cheek pouch use. The observed behavior demonstrates foraging coupled with survival of the fittest because once the squirrel has located food to eat and encounters competitors for food, it is essential for survival to instinctually move away and relocate the food to avoid losing its food and not being able to eat and inevitably survive.